Rebecca, what do you think? Another town? Another basement. I know. Are you ready? I got a monster for me. Okay. Okay. I got a Coke for Craig. Ooh, thank you, buddy. Thank you, buddy. Bag for trash. And no no snacks, man. No snacks? I got three, the last three they have, because okay. these are great for traveling. They and are. So you don't smell. Yep. I got my solution and contacts and gum. Okay, so oh, wait, and hand sanitizer. Because we're gonna be touching people's stuff. Alright, so we're on our way to pick up Greco. We are um is that say 23 minutes? And uh, what are we gonna do? What are you gonna do when we pick them up? Oh, it's a surprise. I think we, surprise? I think we need to videotape it for definitely, yeah. definitely sure. All right, so Mike, what are we doing? We're, picking, we're, not, we're at the airport. We're picking up Greco one, but we wait for Greco, man, Greco style. Because you're gonna get out and you're gonna give them a big, big old hug. No, no shirt no on. Shirt. It's gonna be a epico. If you don't know, uh, uh, Greco likes to show off an Instagram that he doesn't wear a shirt. He does. Insert picture here. Uh. So we're going to see uh, Greco's reaction. This is just the beginning of the journey, so... Yeah. And I do like to be naked. I mean, I don't you have do. a bod. I have a flob. Greco, what's up, buddy? <laughs> hey, what's, what's, up? Your... Oh, God. what's up, bud? Let's go, man. Let's go. <laughs> you got to unlock it. <laughs> We're getting yelled at. What's up, buddy? Hi. Hi, friend. What's up? Deep in the heart of Texas. All right, ladies, uh, Boston Mike's got the camera now. It's Vinny Tassioso. Vinny, hey! Okay, so now we're uh, hey. going to get Ed from Terminal D. For these nuts. These nuts. Hey, Ed! We're over here! Let's go, you damn foreigner! There he is! There he is! Hey! How are you? What's up, buddy? Hey, man. I thought you were going to be out. Come here, you sexy bitch. What's up, big guy? Is it? Oh, you? Hi, man. Buddy! Hey. Another you? person! <laughs> it's so light! Well, I, I didn't bring anything. I gotta bring stuff home, you know? Crack is whack. All right, Dave just joined the uh, the crew. We're What's up? It's official. All five people. We're banging. Accountable. 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 We are, um, we're loaded down, guys. We are loaded down. It's okay. We, okay. We're gonna try to make it to, where, where we're trying to make it first. What place? Uh, uh, toy. Yeah, toy mall. The toy, toy mall. Parlor. Vintage toy mall. Vintage toy mall. We're gonna we're take, all... take it up against the elements. Yeah, we're gonna see what this happens. Car into wreckage. We just we we just, just roll. Yeah. We don't we just ride. We don't drive. <laughs> I'm tired. Yeah. As always. Yeah, I flew here. <laughs> Your wings must be tired. And boy, are my arms tired. So how far is the vintage toy mall? Uh, it is. All right, guys. So Ed's flight got in a little early, like uh, like two, no, an hour and a half early. So the original plan was for us to hit the Vintage Toy Mall in the Tulsa, Oklahoma area. So now we are hauling ass, racing against time to get there. We should get there at 6:06, 120 miles, no, 216 miles away. Just kidding. Um, so we're gonna see if we can get there before seven o'clock. Looks like we made it. We made it. <laughs> Thank God. We made it. 
Look how far we come, my baby. Cracker's like, come on, guys, keep going. What's the, all right, so what's the name of this place? Um, the Vintage. Oh, is it the Oklahoma Toy Mall? Toy Mall. I think it is just Vintage Toy Mall. Not yeah, completely, we're all. completely just a silhouette right now. So, that's um, so yeah, we're chilling. We got, yeah, we're going to have a full hour in here. We made it. Stop number one. Alright, guys, so we are at the Broken Arrow, Oklahoma, at the Vintage Toy Mall. Great place. Pretty big. We only have um, 57 minutes. So, why are we wasting time doing this? I know, this is what we usually do, is waste time. Ed is ready. Alright, let's get inside there. Hi, Eddie. Yeah? You found the superpowers already. That was fast. Oh, this is the mail way. Yeah, there he is. Well, I mean, he got released later yeah. on. Yeah. On I've been looking for her. Wonder Woman. Wonder Woman. Wonder Woman. Wonder Woman. Yeah. Yeah. There you go, Eddie. I, I need to check with Dave which ones I should get. Yeah. Which ones are like deals and which ones aren't. Deals and steals, man. Deals and steals. Deals and steals. Hawkman. Oh, yeah. I like the weird looking one. Swamp things in there too. So. Yeah, but that's Swamp yeah, Thing. Swamp Thing. Yeah. Yeah, so yeah, think about it, think about it. Which way do they go? There they are. <laughs> yeah, they're trying to find the $20 deal before us. Yeah, what do you got? Oh, that's cool. Neck and toy box. All right, so here is a wall of TMNT. Looks like, yeah, mostly all vintage. The Rocket Leo for 20. Um, got a Razor for 10. Look at this dude. Got that jumper. Got a bunch of turts here. And here's a Toon Mikey for 22. And then it's loaded with Power Rangers. Got them all. Where's Jeffy? I don't know where Jeffy's at. Or if he went to the other one. Which one's this? Oh, oh we got a lot of cool what stuff. What city are we in? Broken Era. Oh, we told him that. What's the other city? Oh, Tony Jinx. Huh? What's it, what's it called? Tulsa. There's Broken Arrow is what you're in, but it, just say you're from Tulsa. How far is each one from each other? There, it's like, like a bubble. <laughs> you want to call them? So yeah. You can blame me. Where? Call um, over here. Wait, if you follow me, so. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, okay. Got some Owls of Justice over there. Got some of them figurines. You got a wonky Superman. Yeah, a little bit too wonky for my liking, but I mean for eight dollars, dude. Yeah, some, some more funky guys. Got a Hawkman. Yeah, a bunch of Hawkman. That's a good one. Yeah. We got the minis. Oh, here's one. That's a good one. It's a good price too. Let's see, got Swamp Thing. And then uh, Toy Biz Lex. Which one would you pick up out of Superpower stuff? Today? Yeah. I, I don't know. I think I, I might just pick up Wonder Woman. Oh, that's a Toy Biz one though. It's not Superpower. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's got the thing in the back. We got some carded toys. We got Napoleon right here. We got some G.I. Joe. We got Princess, what's her name? Was that $18? Oh, we got the Bola Jet. Some new adventures. Who's that, the other one? Yeah. It's only like 10 minutes away. Okay. All right, I found this LJN uh, spike right here for 15. Not a bad price. And then there's more turtles down here. Oh, there's a Bootleg. Crap, stuff's just falling everywhere. Check that out. I, I just want. So do you think it's got anything in it? <laughs> I hear some, but you know what? I do have some of the pieces. If it's a uh, man, let's see what's inside. I mean, there's some stuff in it, yeah. No figures. What's the price tag? 18. Is that good? I don't know. Hmm. I found my first purchase. Oh, yeah? 
Yeah. Oh, that's awesome, dude. <laughs> Look at this. It's got the sports that's turtles awesome. on it. Yeah, that It's bike. only 10. Yeah, 10 bucks, too? I mean, I'm, I'm taking this home. Yeah, that's a win. It's a, it's a great backpack for way hunting. <laughs> <laughs> you gonna wear it? Yeah. There you go. Looks good. It's big enough. <laughs> There's a lot of good stuff though. Mm -hmm. Hmm? You don't know about that one yet? I think on it. What we got here? Oh, we got a Robin jet foil. It's elite. But I found this Hogan, so I wonder if they have more over here. Vintage Hogan or new? Oh! Fat Albert. <laughs> you don't see that much. That's yeah. the shit I like to find is unique. Like, look. Oh, that is cool. Russell, Fat Albert. Hey, hey, hey! How you doing, Grex? I'm doing great. I'm gonna buy one thing and I put another thing back. Already? So I'm 50 <laughs> 50, <laughs> baby. Are you overwhelmed? <laughs> We're at that point. Bad 500. Greco, are you overwhelmed? Hey, who collects no, that's the okay. PBC like, uh, Smurfs? Steve. There's bags and bags of them over there. My friend Tim. <laughs> All right, what do we got in these ones? Oh, dude, there's a lot going on over here, too. Look at this. Bats. Bats everywhere. Bats. Bats. And more bats. Go check this out. Oh, look at this. What is that? It's only 40 bucks. Yes. Well, Adventures of Batman okay. Robin. That's a good deal, too. It's That's pretty big. Okay. It's pretty big, man. <laughs> I just bought one Batmobile. What else I got? What do you got so far? Uh, just got the LJN spike so far. Check out this. Exo squad. Down there. Do you collect Exo squad? I don't. I don't. But they're cool to see. Oh, we got some boot He Man. Yeah. You got the, got the cats with them? Not bad. Oh, what are you gonna get? Brack. Space Ghost 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 Ghost. What do you say? Brat from Space Ghost Coast to Coast on card. That's the old one, take it out. That's a good one. I wonder who can get to the guy to open up the case first. <laughs> <laughs> the slight panic in his eyes. I found something I actually want. Yeah. I'm pretty sure I don't have it. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> oh, you don't got it. You need it. Yeah. Go grab them. Get the get the keys. Yeah. Get the keys. You can't get that on eBay right now for like less Are you serious? At least for listed, not sold. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sold is double. Yeah. How much is that? Ninety bucks. Ninety. Ninety. Yeah. yeah. Oh, look at all these villains. They're having a what? Ah, oh, that's cool. Yeah. Looks like a lot of newer stuff, huh? Well, I got yeah. some, some, bales. some 90s, yeah. Some forever. Batman Rubin. Oh, and animated series, too. Riddler for 20 bucks, it's a good deal. Robin. Another Riddler. There's a lot of stuff. There's a lot of Bunch of turtle vehicles, huh? Yeah. Is there anything you don't have yet? Um, Are you working on vehicles right now? Concentrated more on figure stuff. Figures, 100%. Yeah. You gotta recalculate space before you start yeah. looking at this stuff. They're cool. Hmm. Cool. All right. <laughs> Eddie got this, uh, Thank pilot you. on the, uh, no anything. Parachute, parachute time. 25 bucks. It's a good deal. Heck of a deal. 20, 20, 20. Does it have a spinger in there? No. No. It's a fun one. Yeah. The Ninja Newcaster. Yeah. On card for 30. Unpunched? That's a good deal. Yeah, it's a good deal. It's a good condition card, yeah. too. I think so. I like it. I like it a lot. Mike, what you got, dude? Wrestlers. You, you ready wrestlers? for the best one? Yeah, dude. I don't know who he is. Oh, okay. <laughs> I need a Becky Lynch to... There you go. Another Ultra War I don't have, and yeah. I want to find the rest for the Russian Recruit, and I like this one. This is a retirement one. Okay. Welcome to where? I love it. Love it. Oh, that thing is sick. We got Technodrome down here for 300. 
Yeah, some boot Jeffy? leather over here. He's on his way. Oh, Ooh, he look at that. Yeah. Was it bad? No. That is pretty sweet. I don't think I've seen that one. That exosquad, that mech. Huh. Hey guys, I'm Cody. This is our humble abode over here at Vintage Toy Mall in, in little old Broken Arrow, Oklahoma. We got two locations. One is a little bit smaller. That's the one in Jinx is a little bit more like a toy museum where you can buy stuff. This is more a consignment store, you know, where I have all sorts of vendors here that sell G.I. Joe, Transformers, Pops, whatever. If it's from the 80s, if it has, what I like to tell people is if it has a cartoon over it, we probably sell it. So. I'm really happy that these guys are here and I'm really happy we're doing all this because, you know, any publicity is good publicity. Hello, dude. Ooh, Dracula boards. <laughs> got real Ghostbusters, Dracula with cape, 10 bucks. Oh, is that what it is? Yeah, dude. Oh, I thought it was Beetle boards, dude. Yeah. Do, do we need horns for the movie? <laughs> dude, look at these things. What are these things? They're like devil horns. I can see Narc wearing these and having goat legs. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Got stuff? Yeah, I gotta stop. All right. I gotta stop. Who <laughs> are you looking for? Look, there's a Dragon Blaster. I, I have every one, too. That you do. <laughs> you have all of them? Yeah. Um, this looks like a Remco. Oh, bad. Right. It does. It does look like a Remco. 1982. It sure bucks. does. Looks terrible. Yeah, it's pretty bad. I'm not gonna get that. No, no. No, I'm good. I'm good. Can I that guy? What he's from? I mean, I feel like that's a really good price. Twenty-five. You have some. You got a sword too. What do we got down here? D and D. Dungeons and Dragons. Oh, it's so rough. Really? D. Yo, no accessories. Hey guys, we're gonna be closing mm -hmm. like 20 minutes, so can you hurry up? Central. Mm -hmm. I'm saying some shit my day, oh, man. Shit. <laughs> my eyes are fried. 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 Me? Me? What? I got a cowboy for 20 bucks. <gasps> oh, look at that school, man. I don't have him yet. I, I want that school, man. 30? Yes. So you need keys for over here. Yeah, that's, cool. that's a good one. That's a good one. I want to go. That's a nice one. Oh no, I need his. That looks like 150 or 150 and 200. These are test shots. I believe. Um, I don't know. Super 7. I could totally be wrong, but still cool to see. Got some vintage Star Wars. It's a really clean one, too. Look at prices. Who is this guy? Is this guy vintage? Yeah. Really? Clock 2. What? I think his name's Clock 2. And he's vintage? Yeah, dude. Yeah, like vintage vintage? Mm -hmm. Vintage vintage. I might pick him up. 15 bucks? I feel yeah. like it's a good deal. Yeah. Um, like the, Ooh. the what is it? Not the strap, but the, the seat, saddle. The saddle. So. How much is that? He's 25. He's one of the dragons for like the good guys. Good deal. Just telling you. Yeah, that's a good deal. We were looking at some of them earlier. What the fuck is it? What's What's it from? from? I don't know. What is that from? No idea, but it's cool. Is okay. there a stamp? A stamp? I'm gonna tell you where it's from because I'm a genius. You're gonna Google picture that. <laughs> but these would be cool. Yeah. I don't know why. Put some lights in it. Let's see. Some, just see some pirate. Yeah. Chapnisco pirate. Okay. Yeah, it's a good deal. Yeah. It's kind of cool. It's cool though. I think it's really cool. Oh, uh, there's another. Did you see the other Carded um, Beetlejuice? What are you looking at, sir? Some new threads. Some new threads? Yeah. Look at that, Captain America. And, and Minnie Mouse. I moved on. I moved on from toys. Oh, huh? yeah. I'm in the shirt game. Oh, look at that. That's cool. All these bots up here, too. Oh, there's. Beads. Right down. Look at all these bots. Check it out. I rather enjoy this. G2. All those penalties. I know. So many. Prices on them. 25 for weapons and 20 for money. Place it? It's a bootleg. <laughs> oh, yeah. On <laughs> card. Wow. Super nice. Love the uh, 
back Sorry. artwork. Love it, love it. Yeah, I found the uh, Robocop you don't have, Greco. Yeah, you said there is a Cowboys Moo Mesa lunchbox? Yeah, right there. Oh, I see it. Ooh, $30. And it's got the thermos. Oh, look, it's got the thermos. How much? 30 bucks. Oh, that's cheap for That's cheap. That's yeah, cheap. That's a good, that's a good grab. Hey, hey good boys, we can play tonight. Look at these ones. <laughs> Furskins. <laughs> Furskins. Dude, 1986 Furskins. Get the hell out of my house. This is even cooler. Hammer Man. Remember the MC Hammer cartoon? Look at that. Freaking lunchbox. That's dope. This is to you, Spencer Powers. I'm coming for the hurt. Oh, that's cool. I gotta get that, huh? Yeah. Yeah, I have how, this one. How much is that one? 40 bucks. Yeah. Not nice. But they haven't had 209 yet, too. We got some Captain Planet. Got Kwame. Right there. What was the price? 10 bucks for Kwame. He's 10. Oh, there was more. There's only a couple. Ed was saying that this is a uh, ninja assassin, right there, and they're Thundercats. Price very good. Eight dollars. Ten bucks. Not bad. We got a Momra. Hey, do you have any of these? Good deals. And we got Monkey and Walrus Man. Yeah. You should put your figures in. You can fit. All right. Looks like we found some things. What do we got? Yeah. So, got some. Pretty inexpensive Thundercats here. I think I want to get these guys. Pretty clean too. I want 10 bucks, dude. You yeah. can't beat that. Um, hey. What you get? So I picked up yes. a Neighborhood Nasties. That's cool. Yeah, so this is Street Rat Flying Eye. I couldn't find anything else on this one, so I figured it was cool enough for a pickup. Yeah, absolutely. 100%, dude. And cool. I'm going to get this one, Star Wars, over here. The skip? Yeah. Skip card? Yeah. So I'm gonna slowly be trying to pick up some vintage Star Wars and I'm gonna add this one to the collection today. We got a best in Luke or what? <laughs> yeah, no, not yet. Damn it! <laughs> <laughs> we got just Jeffrey in the house. <laughs> just Jeffrey. <laughs> I added a read to you. What do you got? What are you looking at? Uh, oh, that's the cool. completion of these guys is what I got. Oh, you don't have them yet? Does this complete it for you? Yeah. Are you excited? Hell yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's worth the drive right there. Quakers. And I'm done. Oh, wow. I got him. Looks like that, man. Yeah. <laughs> well, I also picked up the last Dreams one. Dreams come true with the toy mall. They do. This is the best day of my life. <laughs> That's okay. That's all right. That's all right. This place is just jam-packed with yeah. cool stuff. I mean, yeah, and some, yeah. yeah. Some is uh, offset. Yeah. Oh, these are really cool ones, too. I guess in my car. Is that what that is? Yeah. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah. So I was like, this is amazing, though. I kind of want it. And then add another boot over here because it's multiple different boots, just sharing the same, uh, the same. Um, how would you say? Space. Yeah. 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 The same. Yeah. The same space, but sharing the same dream of like just bringing toys to everybody. They had one loose. Freaking bootleg. So this is gonna go into the bootleg um, display. And there are a couple cool pieces. We, we got some. Some things for Maddie. I know you've been looking for this, buddy. So I got you the Yeti. We got some um, Primal Rage oh, figures. We got some um, what is it called? Dungeons and Dragons, but like the big PVC type. And this thing, which got Narc really excited. That was that's awesome. Yeah. Um, so this is uh, Centurions, but this is actually a flashlight. flashlight. It's not the actual figure. That would be a lot more than just twenty bucks. So this is a pretty cool curiosity piece but uh yeah i was like dude i want this i found it here as well i'm seeing so much cool stuff here we got last action hero figures like this 
pretty cool. Yeah. I always try to check the backs to see if there's like mailaways or like other fun stuff hidden. Alright, so I pointed out this D&D orc right here for 13. And I'm trying to remember this toy line. It looks super familiar. $10 on it. We're we'll looking into that, but we're looking for more D and D figures, especially the Beast. Oh, is this TSM? Yeah, yeah. But it's kind of like, I'm gonna have to go for this. That's, That's cool. Though. Yeah, <laughs> I, I don't have them yet. That's cool. These are the PVC ones. Do you want like the actual play ones by LJN, or do you want the, the oh. TSR? Um, I want monsters from both. From both? Yeah. Okay. I think this is Christar. That is Christar. Oh, yeah. oh, there you go. I'm going to spend all my money here. Yeah. No joke, dude. <laughs> we can cancel the rest of it. Oh, Nano Puppy. Oh, talk about the, the style. style. Uh, uh, Star-wise. <laughs> Star Some Star Wars. Some Star Wars. That Nano Puppy. I actually had that Nano Puppy. Really? Yep. I used to clean up that Nano Puppy shit. Hmm. That's fact. Fact? Fun fact? The fun fact today. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be hilarious. Would it actually fit though? I don't Will know. it fit? Will it fit? Today on board. Are you happy with your um, stash? Yeah. 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 Definitely. I, don't know I, I like it here. I like it. I like it. I like it a lot. Ed, what kind of food are you in the mood for? Anything. Do you like steak? As long as it's hot food and not salad. <laughs> I'm down with that. How sawgrass is it good? Great shot. I found a lot of stuff I probably didn't need, but the prices were right on the money because I was looking for a deal. That was part of my mission and check more. Got a whole bag full of stuff. Goodies. Goodies. And it even got to keep the bag. So we'll we'll take a look at everything when we get back to the hotel room. I bought one thing which is like a hundred times more than I usually buy. Yeah. So, What'd yeah. you get? Da -da -da. <laughs> so good trip, good yeah. first stop. Yeah, great first stop. Yeah, we only had one hour, but I think we, we covered it pretty we well. Covered it to the fullest. Yeah, we all tried to like help each other out. Like, hey, you like this? You like this workout? Yeah. yeah. I, I, we didn't. I don't remember you guys helping me at all. Yeah, because I don't know play. Because I don't. <laughs> Attic invaders. They didn't have any 90s CD players, right? <laughs> no, no. Old digital <laughs> <cameras>. Yeah. <laughs> Check out with your Sony power shots. And yeah. <laughs> All right. I don't know how to get out of this, so I'm going to go boom. It's got two different parts. Yeah. That's why I want, like, the one yeah, like, with that, that face, not the, the mask. Yeah, I got you. All right. So I got to get a group of oh. feeling we're gonna meet him on this trip. I got a feeling. This is a weird intuition that I have. Probably tomorrow morning. <laughs> Spoilers. 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 Hey guys, what y'all think about the story though? That's cool. I like it. It's cool. Yeah, good yeah, deals. Yeah. I felt yeah. like the prices were right on. Yeah, there was good stuff. I got a great deal. Hey, what does that actually go for? So the la so I paid 90 plus tax, mm -hmm. so plus 200. The last one on eBay that I saw sold for like one ninety. What? Yeah, and then everything that's listed right now is at least three hundred. Okay, so this is like your redemption story from last year. Yeah. 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 Becca, what do you think? Another town? Another basement. I love
What's going on guys and welcome to another episode of Attic Invaders. Well, maybe not a regular episode, but this is still footage that we took on our way up to Kane County. This was actually night one and we had a viewer send us a box full of uh, vintage goodies for ourselves and we recorded the entire thing. I'm currently working on the last episode for the current season of Attic Invaders. So that should hopefully be out next week. And in that video, we are dropping some pretty heavy news. So stay tuned to that. So guys, here's a video from our trip. I hope that you guys enjoyed this. It was a lot of fun to make actually, because it's just us kind of like hanging out and opening toys and talking about it. So, so guys, I hope you enjoy it. Here you go. We need ones. Not for what you think. You guys, you're really thinking strippers, more. no. <laughs> Vending machine out there. And the, the more important thing is that there's only one one between the five of us, and now Mike has to decide what he's going to use that one. The cheapest is dollar twenty five. The cheapest is the dollar twenty five. Did you already it, look? Like, like yeah, savers? I think. It, yeah, I think. It, I, no, Damn it's one scotch rolls. <laughs> oh god, dude. What's up, the pizza? Dude. Candy. You had a giant cookie with ice cream. Dude, that was like giant. Four hours ago. The girl gave us four spoons. Cause she's like, oh yeah, they'll split it. Nope. He said, send those back. <laughs> All right, Mike, what do we got here? Diabetes is what yeah. we have there, Greg. Diabetes. Been there, done that. You know what? I'd rather die happy than, you know? Let's, let's, let's talk start. about it. Let's talk yeah, about it. So got? we got a chocolate chip cookie baked into like a pizza pan. Right, 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 right. And then I throw some ice cream vanilla on top with some, with some chocolate swirl. So what's the plan of attack here? Well, you gotta let it cool down because that pan's okay. really hot. Yeah. You get ice cream because, you know, ice cream. Yeah. Oh, it's not necessary. <laughs> when he sent her away, her face was like. <laughs> yeah, yeah, well, dude, she had to play along at that yeah. point. She was just, like, she was mouthing it hard, though. Oh, oh it's going down. It's... Is it going down? Yeah, sure. yeah. A note from Laura. Attic Invaders, I hope this package finds you guys well. I really wanted to kick off your Kane County Toy Show journey with these gifts. Smiley face. I've been following you guys for several years now. I've learned so much about all the cool vintage toys that are still out there. Probably enough for my channel. Uh, that knowledge has brought me back to the roots uh, with the 80s nostalgia. And it is so cool to find them in the wild. Thank you, Ed, Nark, and Greco for entertaining us. And also, Maddie, smiley face, oh, LOL. Maddie. It is really fun watching you guys together. You guys hella crack me up. She's from California. I hope you guys enjoy your gifts. Uh, there is also a gift for Maddie. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Have fun in King County and be safe. Love, Laura V. Oh, I Thank thought you. it was gonna Sweet. end in like, I know what you did last summer. Because <laughs> like, the, place, the place where now it's it has like some weird vibes. Oh, the place where we're at right yeah, now. Yeah, the like the place where now. Oh, this has, is like, definitely a horror movie. Like, yeah. Like, yeah. Like, yeah, like you were saying, like the, the Kubrick vibes. Yeah, yeah. yeah. we're definitely. gonna give everyone a, like, like some views of this hotel. I, I think and, uh, we we need to put on some dresses and be like mean, little what, toy what, girls. What room has like a freaking firebox in it. You know what I'm saying? I mean, it's cool, but it doesn't work. So how the, cool? I mean, really that's it? the lifestyle. Where you, you see the coffin <laughs> ornament? <laughs> Feel like Jared Leto in that 30 Seconds of Mars video. Are you guys going to get to this thing or what? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Here's, um, top one says, fun. Can I, can I fun say something real quick? Four right. No. Oh, all right. <laughs> this is very important. Why is Craig and Greg Diving in, Ed's sitting way back like he's ready for something to explode. He's, he's not used to Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> he's, he's waiting for Krampus to come he's, out. He's, <laughs> he's like, right, what are we doing? I'm trying to interrupt that broadcast. <laughs> yeah, all right, this is for Ed. So, okay, so it is personalized. Oh, that's cool. Ed's box is bigger than mine. Oh, well, no way. Wow. Yeah, dude. Oh, let's, yeah, yeah, take that out, dude. <laughs> that's wow. crazy. No. Oh, this is too much. What? That is awesome. 
You know what this is? Yeah. Do you know what this is? Yes. Yeah. I, I can read. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's for Ed. Fun fact, I am literate. Oh, okay. Wow. That's crazy. Dude. No. It's Ben Cooper. She got the, uh, the, my spirit animal. Spirit animal? Or is it? Spirit animal. Ordak. Ordak. That's Ooh, dope, that's dude. Sick. Costume and mask. That is. What? Is, is it? Is it? By Ben Cooper? Do you know what Halloween costumes are? You never see Hornack. Uh-huh. And what's the resale value on that? <laughs> <laughs> yes. 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 comps. Yes. Yes. Alright, we're gonna throw yes. comps up right now. Bam! I, 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 <laughs> yeah, right there, right there. Yeah. Over my shoulder? Yeah, yeah. I, I actually haven't seen this one. I know, like, Mur Dude exists in mm -hmm. um, one of the, the Rock Lords. Rock on. Yeah, just picks up the yeah. other one. Maybe. But it's mine. <laughs> yes! <laughs> hey, 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 um, it. is it soon? No. No, no there's a little break. There's a little break. No, I mean, can uh, the top come off? Yeah. I want to check out that map. That's right. Ooh, try it on, dude. It comes with a cape or something. Yeah, dude. It's definitely oh, safe oh, to like draw. That's yeah. rad. I wish you could wear that. At that today, too, that's parent wearing. Mike, let's get into this. <laughs> so you should walk around the hotel wearing this thing. <laughs> comes with a cape? Yes. Whoa. Dude, that's sick. That's awesome. I'll just go and stand on the staircase with this that's on yeah. and yeah. be like, What's up? Whoa, whoa. Oh, wait. I guess we know who that's for. Oh. Well, we'll get to that later. Okay. Troll. Leo. What? That is awesome, because I don't have this club. And this is in much better shape than the one I have. Yeah, I that's think mine is a little fried. I do, Super clean. I do want to point out something. It's like one in the morning. And we've yeah. Been driving all yeah. day. So if the yeah. enthusiasm isn't to like a certain level that you're expecting. Yeah. Oh, I'm gonna, yeah. Here's one for Grecky. Oh, shit. Yes. Oh, don't look. Cheese. Don't look. Don't look. Bum, bum, bum. Oh, it's bubble man. wrap. These are very, very oh, thoughtful. Sad. They are. Oh, These are very, are very, very thoughtful. Oh, and Leah, dude, Leo's your favorite turtle. That's my favorite turtle. Absolutely. Man, look. Awesome. This is really clean. Power glow. So this is what all those um, side mode. Um, no, um, Sonic. Uh, or not Sonic. Uh, yeah, Sonic. Yeah, writers. I really don't need a toy history right now. So it's like, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let me enjoy my gift. <laughs> this, is what, moment, this, is it. <laughs> this is what all the Soma ones are based off of, like the bootleg. Soma. Oh, Toy Island. I, I like the Toy Island figures. Those are way better than huh? yeah. Yeah, this is awesome. Yeah. Let me see that. Does he? Does his thing still? Does it? Does, does it work? It, does it work? Will it fit? Mm. It's okay. Let's. Oh, oh, oh yes! Yeah. Yeah. Whoa! Look at that. I was gonna say, I hope it came with a replacement battery, but look. You're, oh my god. It's a battery not <laughs> That's, cool. That's so cool. That is sweet. That's awesome. Thank you. Four Ed, so you can have uh, him loose. I don't know what it is. Does it say that on there? Yeah. So you get up and loose? Mm -hmm. Is it a hamster? So something that you probably have on card? Mm hmm. Yes. Loose? What? Do you have any idea? No. Okay. If you were to no. guess. Oh, I, I can see what it is now. <laughs> I, I know I have him on card indeed. I don't have him loose yet. Did they just take this off card because it's like in the plastic package? And it's oh, large. that's awesome. So, Playmates toy line from the Adams family. Yeah, and he has his action. I'm glad someone did it. <laughs> you know, this episode, know your toys. Know your toys. Know your toys. <laughs> no, your toys. <laughs> this is so this Playmates, episode of Know Your Toys. Those ones? Yeah. It's mountain dude. Yeah. They're sick. Oh, that's awesome. And then they had like a thing prototype that never came out, so which was going to be like as big as, as, as this mm -hmm. one. Mm -hmm. Wow. That's a cool one. From Belgium. I'm digging in the box, man. So, a uh, draft pile? Draft. Yeah, that's a, that's a draft pile. So, she has on here for whoever wants them, or wants it. And there's all these freaking crazy magazines. No way. So before we get the draft going, this uh, 
was found at the bottom and we had to get this one out. Wow. Hey, part of oh, the dark dope. water on card. Do you have any of those? Yep. No, I have none. Oh, so this awesome. is the first one. I don't even know if I've ever seen one on card. Wow. Really? Person, we yeah. saw a couple on card at Cape County mm -hmm. last year. But oh, I didn't. Look know how, how, how clear that bubble is. For Maddie, because, like, when. I'm not hanging out with these guys. I'm in Belgium, and Maddie is is my, my buddy who I go on. Mighty oh, Max. that's awesome. He's really into um, Mighty Max, and this is the, sealed. Yeah, sealed. Sealed. Which is spoiler totally alert. Toy holiday. Wow. Yeah. Spoiler alert. But Ed earlier today on our first stop, he got him one loose. One loose. Yeah. So and now he has, has one yeah. sealed. So Maddie's going to be pretty glad about this. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> Wow, okay. Thank you so much. Yeah, two of these. This is the to the first pick. Yeah. I'm gonna give you, do you listen? I'm gonna give you a trivia question. We have to answer first, gets the first pick. And then I'll ask okay. another question. I dig that. Okay. You have I it. dig, I dig you Mike being seconds. fucking. You have, Mike. You have four, you grab go, you listen, because this applies to you the most. You have 45 seconds to make a decision. Uh, uh. Or you pass it. <clears throat> okay. Because, you know, six hours of doing a draft that takes 20 minutes. <laughs> It's kind of for the birds. <laughs> okay, these right, are just like books. 20 seconds. Whatever looks good. pretty. Good. Oh, look at this one, dude. We're at the uh, Columbine right now. <laughs> Wait, we're at Columbine? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> exactly. I mean, yeah, I was like, what did they say? Columbine. <laughs> <laughs> Is it the Columbine? Columbine. Columbine. Uh, look at this raft poster. That's pretty sick. That's raftastic. The cameraman's gonna give me a. I'm gonna ask for a category. Okay. He's gonna give me a category to ask you guys a question. Isn't that an easier way to do? So this? category. Oh no, I mean like so you ask your ask. I'm gonna all. ask a question. Yeah, it's first gonna... one to answer it gets the first pick. I'll okay. just whip them out and see. Electrons. Electrons. All right, nineties cartoon. Nineties cartoon. In the cartoon, hey Arnold. Okay. Damn. Who's <laughs> Arnold's best friend? The other kid. Oh shit. Cheryl? I know. Yes. Oh, yeah, there it is. You gotta think this one. one. I was like, come on. <laughs> <laughs> did you grab it? Which one did you go for? Uh, Show the camera. Oh, this oh, one. Yeah. So Sergeant what? Bananas what? on it. It's got some. Let me see. Damn it. Turtles on tour. Magic in there. That's oh, a good yeah. one. <laughs> okay, next. Come on. Move. All right. Let's no, no, go. you can't. No, 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 no. It doesn't go in order. No, I know. I just don't no, know. You can look. You can still look. I just don't know. Yeah. I'm going to take 45 seconds to pick one. All right. 90s sitcom. 90s sitcom. Friends. Always friends. <laughs> Who does Jay Seinfeld hate the most? Newman. Newman. Oh, God, I said it. That's right. Uh, I'm gonna take this. Oh. Yeah. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Good choice. Where'd you go? On the clock. 45 seconds. It? Unless you want to trade. Oh, we can trade? Oh, like, I can trade this. To get Ed? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. How about we get Yankee Swap? Yeah, Yankee Swap. <laughs> Ed, we're playing Yankee Swap. Did you grab Craig, it? Now Craig gets to pick no. either from oh, you. Oh, you're still picking. No, I can either um, take this one or I can pick one of y'all's. What? Yeah. what? No one ever says the first pick's good. It's like the white <laughs> yeah. elephant. So you picked already? So I'm next, okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What's happening? Dude! Oh, boy. That was He's another one of those. Yeah, that was another one. Yeah. <laughs> But damn it, damn it, dude. Who had the rap poster? You had it? You took it? Yeah. Just because yeah. it didn't seem as rare now. <laughs> oh, All right, we're gonna, we'll look at the halls closer. Oh, okay. Uh, there we go. All right, well, I already have one of those. So. Perfect, because I didn't have that, and I had that, so. Yay! It worked, worked out? It. it worked out. All right, quick, quick run through, quick run through. What you got? I got these At first. first. Bam. Oh, <laughs> and bam. We just want to say a huge shout out to Laura for sending us that box. That brought us a lot of joy. So thank you so much, Laura. We really appreciate you. And guys, make sure you're following. Hit the like button. Subscribe to the channel if you have not yet. And guys, we will see you in the next one. Peace. Becca, what do you think? Another town? Another basement.
Missouri was established in 1854 by uh, Peter Bronson. We're here, finally, at the Celebrity Car Museum. Yeah. I feel like we're doing the Ghostbusters commercial from the movie. Let's go! You have spook specters. <laughs> wait, wait, everyone stand right above. Come here. Come, keep coming. Stand behind me. Oh. Oh, he's taking a picture. Yeah, great angle. Hey, I'm Andy from the Celebrity Car Museum here in Branson, Missouri. We're right here in the middle of Branson, across the street from Dixie Stampede. We have over 100 cars used in movies and TV shows, some cars that were owned by celebrities. 90% of our cars are the actual cars used to film the movie or the show. So that's kind of our claim to fame. Let's take a look around, you guys can see everything. Then we'll go inside and have a look. Nope. This big thing up here is the NXT. That was uh, The Rock drove that in The Fate of the Furious. So over here it's going to start. This is uh, just David Schwimmer's personal Jaguar. This is from back when they were all making like a million dollars an episode. <laughs> so, <laughs> so when it got repoed, it got taken here? I think he sold it off. I think he has a whole fleet of cars. Oh, I'm just playing. This is one of Sam's cars. This is one of the cars they drove in Supernatural. Oh, that's cool. This is from when they like, at one point Sam came back and didn't have a soul. It was like on his own. Yeah. This is the car he was driving in that time. This is the Rocks van from Black Adam. We just got this one. That's the RV they steal in Stranger Things Season 4. Now, do they sign anything in here? Like, uh, This one's not signed. A lot of the other cars inside have signatures and things. We bought this one direct from the, like, the vehicle manufacturers who do all the cars for them. So this is, a, this is the actual picture car? Yeah, this is the car they stole that they used on film. There's two RVs. Well, that's this the is just the one they down. steal when they're oh, trying to get back. Oh, yeah. And then right. this Ford Falcon here was Clint Eastwood's from that movie, Cry Macho. Oh, okay. yeah. And it was also in Ford versus Ferrari because they talk about how they're building the Falcon. Mm -hmm. So there's a whole like uh, factory full of them in Ford versus Ferrari. Uh, this is from Dumb and Dumberer, the one where they were teenagers. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's their school bus. I want this bus, dude. Yeah. <laughs> that is the coolest bus half. Dude, this would be. Would you take this over yeah. a truck? Yeah. The next to it is uh, <laughs> Philip Seymour Hoffman's bus from Twister. Oh, yeah. what? This one's been around for a while. Bruno was the second movie that Sasha Baron, Baron Cohen ever made. Oh, yeah. This is from Bruno. I don't think it actually made it into the movie. But it was supposed to be like the, a truck he was doing when he goes camping with some rednecks or something. Uh, I have po I like the. It came with photos of him like posing next to it with a big sniper rifle <laughs> and a whole bunch of other stuff. But I don't think it's in the actual movie. I mean, I am in a market for a new truck. It's another one of our Stranger Things. And then here's the Ecto. Greco, what would you offer for the mystery machine? Uh, let's see what I got in my pocket here. <laughs> Attic Invaders invading the Celebrity Car Museum. Like I said, Knight Rider is the first car because that's what everybody wants to see. He's the, the solid. This is Johnny Depp's motorcycle from Crybaby. Alright. That's one of the fake cutout cars from Talladega Nights. Oh, really? When they just wanted to have like cars in the background, I think. Yeah. And then I think the Pennzoil box is from it, too. That's perfect. Yeah, I did that. Wayne's World. Yeah, exactly. Everyone loves that one. Hi, I'm Wayne's World. Party on. Do you want to sit in it and do that? Yeah. 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 Really? Yeah, get in there. Both of you guys. I'm Wayne. <laughs> you got to do an impression, though. Red body. I'm Wayne Campbell. I'm Garth hey. Brooks. <laughs> How are you already? This is freaking awesome! From Flintstones Viva Rock Vegas. It's, wow. uh, it's, it's a golf cart underneath there, basically. That's a big friggin' action figure. 
This is my favorite of the Jurassic Parks, though. Yeah. A little bit dinged up. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> this one was apparently uh, used to be on like the waiting line for one of the rides okay. at Universal Studios. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, trying to get through the American. Oh, Beverly Hills Cup. Oh, Beverly Hills Cup. That's awesome. And this is supposed to be Storm Shadow's jetpack from G.I. Joe, but I think it's in a deleted scene. Okay. Mm -hmm. oh, yes, the one I've been waiting for is I right there. I want to sit in that one. <laughs> oh, yeah. the 18-bit? Yeah. Everybody loves the 18. <laughs> this is probably my favorite Fast and Furious car. Really? Yeah. Yeah, there's a giant bear in there. Yeah. 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 You want to be an advocate? Hey, tell me how you feel right now. I feel good. Feeling good? It's pretty tight, actually. Like, but, I mean... Who drove the van? Mr. T. Yeah. So you think he fit in here? Probably. I mean, I guess a chain or two. Is that one like... That's pretty sweet, like, man. Two weeks yeah. ago, I'm working right to some guy. Ooh, there's some toys here. No, no. Ooh, some blue. No. It's the, the Kenner uh, Robocop. Oh, it's just some autographs and swaps. Kenner Robocop? Oh, yeah. I just saw this. Yeah, how much? Yeah. How much? <laughs> how much for it? No, I actually yeah. do want it. Oh, yeah. I know. Yeah. This is... Oh, not that one, though. The talking one. Yeah. Yeah. This one's really cool, though. Yeah, this is uh, Will Ferrell's car from Land of the Lost. Oh. Mm -hmm. And then this is one I really enjoy. This is one of the hearse from the end of Terminator 3. But if you take a good look at it, it is just completely chewed up with bullet holes. Like down this side, there's like 130 bullet holes. And all these lines on the front wow. are from when the evil Terminator lady was hanging off the hood. And her hand was just like a saw and she's sawing into it. Oh yeah, and they got all the rips on the top. Yeah. Everything, man. You got the bat bomb. You have um, tire repair devices. You got the bat phone. Check out that phone. I'll be right there, Commissioner Gordon. Yeah. It's signed by him too. Yeah, it's not by the guy. That's Chad, who also was Jesse in the Fast and Furious movies. Oh, okay. And then that's um, the guy that played the original Alistair, Alistair. Mark yeah. Robertson. I think he was also in Aliens. Yes. Anybody we run into at a convention that was in the show, we yeah, have them signed. All right, guys, so I'm sitting inside of the uh, car they use for the TV show Supernatural. Pretty freaking crazy. This is one of my favorite, like, TV cars. I think I gotta get in those cars. <laughs> Dude, this whole section is me. Yeah. So is this for you? Yeah, these are all the oh, That's crazy. And then all the Transformers are the actual screen used cars. But supposedly, if you look real close at the door, on Barricade, you can see the two dents in the door yeah. when Sheila Booth hit it on his bike. Okay. <laughs> you can see where he hit it in his bike. Screen used. Screen used, baby. Here you go. Brittany Bax. So, oh, Megan Brady. Fox sat on this one? Oh, she was just like this, wasn't she? Yeah. She was like doing like this. <laughs> With it, but none of the hood. Yeah, there you go, man. Got a good Megan there you Fox. Go, man. Get in Bumblebee, bro. This is movie magic, baby. I should have, it should have been me! <laughs> what are you thinking, dude? I, I'm in a Transformer. You're in freaking Bumblebee? Bumblebee, baby? Screen used. Yes! So this is a quite a turn of events. Normally, Greco has Transformers inside him, but today, <laughs> he's inside a Transformer. Wait, there's no, there's no proof of that. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this. From Logan, remember 
like those uh, dudes like chasing them through the desert, trying to track them down. The, uh, the one of the jeeps. Uh, dude. Hi, hey guys. My name's Andy. Thanks for watching the videos. Come see us here at the museum in Branson, Missouri, Celebrity Car Museum. We usually have over 100 vehicles on display. Transformers, Fast and Furious, Stranger Things, all your favorites. You want to get your picture taken in one of the cars? That's available too. Rebecca, what do you think? Another town? Another basement. Like two and one. Ooh. What do you want? A spicy one. I don't know where to begin. Get all of this. Yeah. This is a. Uh, yeah. So much. Charlie Long. That's Paul's dad. You're gonna stack up, aren't you? Yeah. 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 You gonna go cray cray? Yeah. 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 There's no reason not to. No. Honestly. I mean, some good comments you can get in there. Good price, you know. Yeah. Ooh. Let's see this guy. 18. That's good. You think I should like hold on to stuff? I, I don't know, man. <laughs> you were kind of vibe. I, I, yeah, I mean, there's gonna be, you're gonna see so much. Like, <sighs> it's a tough call, dude. All right, I should probably hold on to the Ewok then. Okay. Right? Yeah. So, what's great about his Joe's, he goes from 82 to 94, the first run, and he goes from complete all the way down to just a figure or just weapons. So it's so organized. Oh, yeah. 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 That is awesome. Yeah, I don't know if you guys can see, but everything is kind of dated. Looks like you can be something. I'm gonna, come on, dude. That's an expensive card. Most of most your toy stores lock that shit up. We got Nikes. One day I will get into it just to kind of learn more about them. Well, Boston Mike will always teach you. Oh, I was asking him. Oh, here we go. Yeah. yeah. And are you making yourself at home, dude? <laughs> He's starting to uh, warm up a little yeah, bit. Get in the feels. Yeah. Get in the vibes. Do some toot now. I'll, I'll do a little toot. Here's some turtles. 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 See any what? Like later release ones? Later release. I mean, do you have this on up here? Yeah. yeah. Cyber Samurai. Yeah. Already so, <laughs> We're in that spot where all the hard ones are pretty, pretty up there and hard to find. You see all this, Ed? Look at all this. The nitros, Leonardo. Is that the roadster? The roadster. Yeah. That's nice. Oh yeah. The sliders. Ripping you a new one. Ripping you a new one since 1988. We got a troll wrap. But his hair is like, oh man. He got a haircut. Got creepy scar. I used to actually own one and I'm a dumbass sold it. And, you know. <laughs> Talking Leo. Check it out. Kitty Raffy. 
Okay, let's um, VHS over here. It's a Big Mac. Yeah, it's just a bunch of cartoon ones, yeah. Easter Bunny, you know, those big crossovers. Yeah. Yeah, lots of cool. Burger King Kids Club, baby. Hmm. We're dealing with a real mind here. Ha! Now this is Burger King by Storm, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle video. <laughs> Collect four adventures you won't find anywhere else. Three forty nine dollars with any purchase. Prices may vary. For a limited time, only at Burger King. California yeah, I don't have that one. Do you collect? Should I actually collect these? Mm -hmm. oh, that's pretty neat. Bodacious. 48 minutes of yeah. cartoons on that guy. Tim and G could. Hot riding, baby! So My name is Rob. Uh, I'm the owner here, but I like to pay, tell people. Not the boss, uh, the owner. My 13 year old daughter is the boss. <laughs> so uh, if you have a daughter, you understand. This store has 17,000 square feet from top to bottom, and it is GM packed with everything you could think of in the vintage toy world. Uh, we try to be as organized as possible. You kind of hit us on a day though, and we're, we've got our own show here coming up Saturday. We just bought a ton of stuff, so we're incorporating that into what we've got. So I promise it's not usually this messy. Although I tell it to everybody every day for years. So um, <laughs> at some point, someone's gonna catch you on. So um, our basement is 5,000 square feet. It actually used to be a morgue. Uh, this place was originally a funeral home many years ago, so there's some pretty cool uh, ghost stories. The basement is where we keep our overstock and also our storage. Um, we kind of work on stuff down there when we have the time, but we try to save and organize down there. So we'll show off kind of what we do there. Let's hit the basement. <laughs> Come on, Let's go. Let's kick in an old school. That, that was Ed's polite way of asking if he'd, if he'd mind if he used his restroom. Right around the corner. Hey, how are you? I wasn't hungry, but I drank me about 37 Dr. Peppers. The, uh, we have the, like this is all of our vintage Joe line, they're vehicles, and so they're organized by year and by type. We buy a big lot. Oh, we bring it, by the way, the ghost sometimes does weird stuff. You, like, <laughs> you guys think I'm making that up, but... You're like, no. um, there's a, some bunch of tubs back there of stuff we just picked up at a, a estate sale. Yeah, you guys are welcome to dig through stuff, and there's all kinds of random treasures in here. Everything down here is for sale, it just hasn't made it upstairs yet. Can you place it? It is. And if you find dinosaurs, I'm a huge dinosaur collector. I keep every dinosaur I find. Mini place it? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Look at these. Look at these base innovators. Yeah. Why don't you guys head to the third floor? Yeah, this is our <laughs> this territory. This is our territory. Yeah, this guy, actually. <laughs> yeah, that's cool. Ooh, there, you go. there might be more accessories. So we got one from Belgium, yeah. Massachusetts, and the rest are out there. D and D. Oh, awesome! Oh yeah, there's more D and D. Here's yeah. a sword here. So, uh, this was point? a crazy uh, sword. Yeah. This is the. Hey, it's a sign, man. Look at that. That's Dallas Cowboy. Yeah. Um, that's a good one. We find some D and D, man. Dude, you were on the hunt for some D and D. Yeah, man. This is a big win. Big win. Hello. Check this out. Yeah. Ooh, that's cool. Many. But very few people will look at a bucket like that and see. I mean, that's the show. That's the basketball thing, right? Yeah. Oh, I actually have the figures. There you go. There is a there's an original Mego Spider-Man in here. I saw that the other day when I was down here. And this one? Pulled it back out in one of these. Yeah, I actually already promised this that to somebody. Oh, okay. uh, I love I love Mego just because toy history. There is that great history. There's uh, yeah. I know there's the Mego uh, Tar Friar Tuck is down here. Uh -huh. um, the Lone Ranger is down here. We have Tonto. We have Silver. So I've kind of seen some stuff and just not been able to do oh, much yeah. with it as we're going around. We like, so now we're downstairs yeah, in the basement of Peddler's um, Post. Um, pretty well organized. All of this is there's just multiple giant play sets for uh, GI Joe and everything. There's still some some uh, some uh, Virgin boxes we went through. Craig, he cleaned out Dungeons and Dragons wines. Yeah, I'm done. Yeah, I'm done. 
No, not really. I, I saw lots of stuff upstairs already that I want to really take a look at. Um, but uh, yeah, when they say when they say like there's a downstairs, you gotta go and check it out. Yeah, it's crazy. Man. Um, so Greco's still looking around a bit, <laughs> but this is this is attic invader style, yeah. right? This yeah. is this is down to the uh, the nitty gritty, right? Our last stop was the Vintage Toy Mall in Oklahoma, and that's when I started picking up vintage D and D figures. So of course I'm gonna be on the lookout for more at Peddler's Post. When Rob took us down to the basement, he said that everything was for sale and he pointed to an area that had some unprocessed products. So we went to town and found some more D&D &D figures. So I ended up picking up these knights right here. So this is LSR Dungeons and Dragons, Steadfast and Stalwart and um, I got these at a really good deal. That's gonna be at the end of the video. I also got a young male Titan figure and then Ed found the helmet for him, which makes that even a sweeter deal. In that same box, we found this LJN D&D Zorak right here, check him out. So we got him and uh, yeah, it was, a, it was a great find. In those boxes, my favorite kind of hunting not processed, not priced. That's exactly the kind of hunting us Attic Invaders love doing. Going through the unprocessed stuff that nobody has looked at yet. So, Rob, thank you for that. Are you finding stuff other than this? I mean, I, dude, I, I'm seeing it's overload, honestly. Yeah. So, right now you're it. trying to hone it in, get a view of everything, and exactly. then make I more mean, decisions. Look at these cases, man. Like, it's crazy. Yeah. Yeah. You got Cadillacs and dinosaurs. We got Dick Tracy. Got Dennis Rodman. Yeah, Bucky, Centaurians, and Boxy. Look at this. Echo Squads. Ooh. Cops and Crooks and Box. Yeah. Wow. We found some good news. Cat, the, cat the powers. You always find stuff like that in the yeah. jet. You never find the one. You never see the one. Oh, that there's wings. Yeah. Wings are very cool. I want to ask oh, about dude. that one and about the over the top. Yeah. Uh, dude, over Remember, there. I sold you a few of them. Yeah. All right. I call dibs on it. You got it. You got it. You help me out with this, man. I call dibs. <laughs> Damn scarecrow. It's all about me. Yeah. <laughs> I, I picked I it out first. No, I, I I saw it first. I got it for him. You guys were there. Did you ask Rob to get it? Hey, do you I asked you to get it. Do you remember what happened at Trader's Village? <laughs> no, no. no. I, I so something it. happened. I was like, don't give it to him. Hey, so I just took it out of the case and he said, give it to me. So. <laughs> Yeah, man. Oh, he's ready to cry. Can I have a look at that? Oh. <laughs> I knew it. I knew it. He was just, oh, that's just a, Josh and Dinkling me. That's a beautiful piece. It's in just incredible shape. Like I'll be the face hey, These are like very, very, very fragile, too. Uh, very, very I fragile. I can like, work for, right? Uh, what do you think? Arm wrestling? Yeah. Uh, like this guy? No, this one. <laughs> no, he arm wrestles. No, he has one. His this is minty. That's it. So the he chaos effect is awesome. like. Awesome. Yeah, I'm getting the chaos. I got some. Because the Mexicans the creme de they bring creme them to me. Jurassic My Park Simpsons, life. I have the best so Simpsons. Like, last line or what? Oh, I don't know what it is. It's just like there wasn't that many of them, and it's just the colors. Yeah. And maybe that makes them a little bit more desirable. We just got stacks of vintage cards. Oh, this is a margin I was like. I can kind of feel in this DSL for 100. Yeah. Yeah. That'll be your entire bag. Uh, so I just noticed a box G1 transformer that I'm pretty sure I don't have. So I just asked for some assistance. Uh, actually, it was more offered to me. So that's a great, <laughs> great customer service. Um, and they're just trying to figure out what the deal is with that. So cool. Are you looking for a price on it? Is that what you're trying to get? Yeah, exactly. Because yeah. I don't know. Uh, again, it's one of those situations where I already have the figure, but I just need the cardboard. So okay. I'm trying to make okay. it work, you know? Is there anything else that's jumping out at you? Um, I you, is it kind of all overwhelming right now? Yeah, I mean, there's no, I mean, we're still on the first floor. Yeah. There's two more, I think, so uh, I'm just trying to take it all in. Did Greco ask for GoBots? Yeah, he did. So that's like a Greco. I don't know if you guys saw that. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. Evil Nightmare. The Secret Wars. Yeah. I actually have both of those, but. That. Check yeah. out this Power Lord. Evil Nightmares. That's a. Uh, yeah, the Evil Nightmare is fire, dude. Yeah. With box like that? Yeah. Wow. There's more cops figures in. Oops. Oh. 
Oh, small soldiers. Oh, soldiers. Yeah, those are goodies. Some trolleys. I had uh, oh. Mega Force. We got dude. We got some sharkies. You don't have there. You don't have either of those, do you? I don't because I have been in and out of yeah. the uh, Street Sharks game, and recently I've kind of dived back into it. So these are really cool additions to the collection. If I do decide to pick them up, I'm kind of just looking at them right now, and I'll, I'll go for them. Uh, action work for this one for uh, his tongue. Um, what is the action? Let's see. I, d I don't think it's the nubs broken. Oh yeah. yeah. And did this had what kind of nub was it? It, it, it yes. like uh, twirled. No, the, oh, yeah, it's a bummer. And we got this guy. Ripster. Well, he's actually works good. Yeah. Yeah. He's kind of a fun piece. He's one of the more common ones, but he's he's still really fun. No, um, he But yeah. Yeah. So. We'll see. We'll see what's up, right? We'll see. Okay. Uh, show me what you got a little bit. I think. Give it. Give everyone a little bit so of I taste. Think Mike picked this up. Dragonflies? Dragonflies. I did. Oh, That's you did. Eight, you did. Okay. <laughs> and then you got your two pieces in there. And then look at all this D&D &D goodness. Bunch of D&D. &D. Yeah. So who's collecting the D&D &D right now? I guess I am. Yeah. You going down you, it? You do I'm happy bit. that you found them because it's bit. like... I don't see them very often so and to find them in a box the way that you did yeah, it's pretty, pretty is kind bad. of extra fun. Now it's time to negotiate. Let's see what kind of deal we can get. Right, Which is longer than that damn Roman Reigns. So wheeling and dealing time. I'll put these back. Yeah. Wheeling and dealing. So, like, so my Cobra Commander. Man, the cheapest this guy is online is like 70 bucks. So I would, I mean, mm. we're gonna do 40 on him. No brainer. All right. He's at a one and a quarter in the store, but you got 350 and 40 is 90. I'd probably do three, four, 475. Deal. Shit, 85 on here. 485? 475. All right, I'll do that. Wait a minute. Yo, he has his gun up here. I didn't know if he was gonna. All right, who's next? next? You're the man with the treasures. Yeah. Now tell me about this, because I am totally unfamiliar with this toy. So, Super 90s, here I'll show it to you. Okay. I think you're fine. Um, so, Super 90s, um, they're, you don't see them very often, but at the same time, they're not very sought after, and that's kind of why. But yeah, you had a, a Barbie toy line like that. Yeah, got yeah. Into trouble. Yeah, dragonflies, which was exactly the same thing. Didn't. So, it's yeah, dragonflies or yeah. dragonflies? Yeah, with with his head. With his head. Yeah, F L Y Z. But if you check this out, check this out, right? Remember a couple of Christmas ago, that there. was like a, like there was yeah, they, they they kind of they use it yeah. There was like a little girl toy, it was like a ballerina or whatever. Yeah, it's, uh, or yeah, so. this Sky Dancers, I think it yeah, was that. Yeah. Yeah. Huh, yeah, I've never heard of them, I've never even seen this toy line before. Yeah. They're fine. Is it, is it stunted or is that the actual size of this thing? No, this is, this is it. Even sealed, 30 bucks is their sealed cost. Uh, exactly, not they're not, expensive. they're not expensive yeah, at all. I've never heard of them. Because, yeah, I mean, they, I think these are kind of toys that make it to the point. Whatever you want. You have, that? like, the, the, the bad guy who has, like, a bigger one, but yeah. this no is, way. like, the regular size. I, I appreciate the info. Like, I love learning about toys, and, I mean, it's hard to find stuff I've never seen. Yeah, well, they're really fun. fun. Yeah. All right, guys, so we are all finished up here at Peddler's Post in Missouri. We got a lot of really good deals. We got some stuff for our collections. Rob, where can everybody find this amazing place? Well, we're available as a brick and mortar store, which we get that question a lot. Uh, we're in Bolivar, Missouri, which is a town in southwest Missouri, about two hours south of Kansas City. We're pretty centrally located to Oklahoma City, St. Louis, Kansas City, uh, Little Rock, Arkansas. We're sort of in the middle of that area. Um, we are online. Peddler's Post Bolivar is our Facebook page, and that is our primary way to get a hold of us. We sell on Whatnot as Toys R. Ross. Uh, last name is Ross. I didn't come up with it, but I most definitely stole it from my friend who did. Uh, we are on, uh, he looked at me very suspiciously there. Uh, we're also on Instagram at Chubby Toy Geek. That's the best <laughs> way to get me on Instagram there. So, between whatnot, Facebook, and Instagram, we're pretty easy to get a hold of. So, right on. awesome, man. Yeah. Well, thank you. Pan out on the sneeze machine. Sneeze yeah. machine, man. Yeah. Sneeze we, machine. we appreciate you. And on that note, we're going to show you the sneeze machine, machine and then be out. Guys, you want to stay tuned because we have more episodes of Attic Invaders coming up. Make sure you're following Ed's Retro Geek Out, Greco Fabulous. Uh, we got 
a lot to cover, guys. We've got a lot of ground to cover. We're not even halfway through this journey yet, so let's get it. All right, so we just did a, uh, a Boston Mike snack stop. We're gonna make our way towards St. Louis, but we're gonna, oh yeah, here, where are we at? Point us, point us on the map, baby. We're right here. All right, so we're right there-ish. And we're going up. But I wanna tell you about my gambling friends, Mr. <laughs> Narc, not another retro channel. Yeah, what did you pick up from the gas station? Um, fried mushrooms from the gas station. So you got gas station mushrooms. Yeah, they're tasty. <laughs> All right, more importantly, what I wanna hear, who I wanna hear from, is this man hey. right here. Hey, everybody. So, I'm our risk taker. Yeah, so we're in Missouri. What, what did you get? So, we're in Missouri, and I was like, well, while I'm in the area, I might as well try the local flavor. Local being a Louisiana meat pie. Isn't it like 15 hours south? Yeah, so you picked up a gas station meat pie. I did. And a gas station meatloaf meat sandwich. Meatloaf sandwich. Yeah. See, see, that's, that's ballsy. <laughs> that's fucking that's ballsy, ballsy, right, dude? I don't know. That's a little ballsy too. What did you get? I, I got a bacon cheeseburger. I, I want bacon cheeseburger too. That's for technical time. What did you get? Pizza bean burrito. Yeah, there you go. Then you got cheese curds, then you got fried mushrooms too. Yeah. So I will, uh, I will update everyone as soon as the first version ships their back. Becca, what do you think? Another town? Another basement. I know we gotta get it. Hey, All right, so on the way to St. Louis, we were driving on through and what to our wandering eyes should appear, but this toy shop, Toys for Life, this was not on the agenda, this was not on our roadmap at all, but we saw it, we slammed on the brakes, hit, like, did some Fast and Furious Tokyo Drift stuff, and we ended up here. It's all thanks to Narc because he has a good eye. He saw the My Pet Monster. Yeah. They have that, one on the inside as well. Yeah, that's an incredible eye. So we're gonna check out the pickups as soon as we get back. Woo! Oh, you got a. Uh, what's that? Mad balls. Mad balls? Sweet. Don't ask me questions about anything because I don't know what any of this shit is. Okay. I work with the cards. You can make up stuff. Pom -poms. I'll work wow. I'll, I'll work How much is that dark water thing? Which one? The yeah, I, high I, season thing. That's the price for 200 Okay. I like the fourteen ninety seven better, but. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, that's cool. That's cool. Wow. Yeah, 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 yeah. So we have, it looks like they are 15 each on all. I got them all. Are you in that? I don't know because I don't price any of them. They, the owner is not here. Wow. Finding any goodies? There's some good things for sure, but just. A lot of it's missing pieces. So I saw that Dr. Terror um, Centurion's over there. He's missing like a rocket. He's missing like an arm, a gun. 70 bucks. But I think complete is around 100. So it's kind of like, eh. Yeah, it's one of those ones where you're going to probably pay more trying to get yeah. up to the, those parts. To that complete. Are you finding anything? Nothing's like jump it out to me and be honest. I'm gonna be asking about that monster in my pocket yeah. thing. <laughs> you're good. I have no idea what it is, but I have a lot of monster in my pocket. Really? Yeah. So I think that's pretty cool. Yeah. You wanna help me carry this out? What are you thinking, Craigie? I'm thinking, I mean, we, we were not 
planning on planning stopping. Because, because you just saw like, I was like toys. I saw my pet monster and I was like, holy crap. But I mean, the prices on like the loose stuff is really good. Mike, he found me a ton of Monster Force stuff. Look at that. I'm always looking out for my board. Th this one is open, but most of these are still sealed in package. Yeah, these are good. I don't actually have these. I definitely gotta pick these up. Hey, what do you got? You see those prices? Yeah. Why do you think that is? I have no idea. What did we learn from our collective friend? I don't remember. You don't remember? What is it? These were made in India. Uh huh. Hey, Ed. Does he remember? Oh, yeah. <laughs> don't grab. Don't grab. There the what is it? Leo toy? Mm-hmm. Leo toy. Yeah. Oh wow, and this is a deep, not flock. Not flock. Wow, no. that's cool. Those are cool fun. Yeah, that's nice. Are they pickups? Silver hawks in yep. Yeah. You don't see these. Are you gonna pick those up? I actually grabbed that Remco no. over there. Uh, <laughs> but that's crazy. <laughs> Lesson learned, never eat fried mushrooms from a gas station. Weird things happen. So this stop was not planned. I happened to look over in the car and see this toy store tucked away in the shopping center. They had some really good items in it. The, I guess the highlight for myself was seeing those Leo toys in there. One, you never see them. Um, two, uh, I kind of wanted to pull the trigger on them, but I don't know the prices for these, uh, these variants because they are from India. Uh, comps on them on eBay were kind of, they're everywhere. And the guy, I think he had like 250, 240 on them. So I'm gonna hold off on these for now, but still very cool to see. This next stop is Time Warp Toys in St. Louis. Once again, this was not in our plans. So when we were eating dinner the night before, I looked it up and I was like, hey, let's, let's hit up Time Warp Toys. So Time Warp Toys, let's go. All right guys, so we are at Time Warp Toys. Uh, here outside of St. Louis, so we're gonna go inside see what they got. Don't know nothing about the store, but hopefully I got some good stuff. Let's check. Uh, some Transformers. Uh, there is. I like me some Beast Wars. Got some Beasties? I got some Beast Wars. Oh yeah. Love that. Flag. The flag. We've seen a lot of some flags mobile commands. <laughs> Oh, we've seen a lot of uh, flags. It's on this not thing. that rare. They're everywhere. They're everywhere. They're everywhere. There we go. Stay awake, Craig. Hey. That's all we got. Here's a Moomba. A Moomba. Moomba. Whoa. Hey. Uh, they don't throw around hey. stuff. Hey. He literally yeah. said, "Don't throw yeah. anything." With the troopers. You want to make a move on us? Yeah. Or? I mean, I do. Okay. What's gonna happen here, yeah. Phyllis? I mean, but I will. They got Robin back here too. Um. Let me know if you don't get him. All right. <laughs> Dude, we got another. What I think um, is very special here, Craigie. Yeah. And I want to point it out to you. Yeah. Check this bad boy out. Uh, that is uh, a repurposed uh, mold from the samurai. Samurai turret. Yeah. yeah. I don't know what it's for. Is this actually a turtle? Wow. That looks cool. That's that's the old mold just being repurposed. Got some dino riders. Are you gonna make a move? I think so. On the suits? Yeah. I mean, he's significantly cleaner than ones I typically run into. Oh. I feel like that's a good price. Yeah, it is. Mike, what'd you find it, dude? I can't remember if I got this one or not. Wrestlers. Gotta get the bootleg. <laughs> that's Which a bootleg that? Hogan. Oh, nice. Gotta get that. I feel like you have that warrior. I gotta see. <laughs> Who's that? Oh, that's too perfect. Oh, I don't like that one. How much is he? Can't this guy's right? Yeah, yeah, right yeah. here. Those original claws. Yes. Who is it? 75? 75 for Indy? Yeah. yeah. They came in black and gray. 
I mean, I never see them, but yeah. I, I didn't know that those were the prices. Oh, that one? Yeah. No, I don't. Oh, wait. Yeah. Yeah. yeah I, you might as well do something I mean, I, that's why yeah. I was very quiet over here. <laughs> Let's look through them. They're trying to keep all these turrets away from me? Well, yeah. That's why I was quiet. Yeah. Oh, Ooh, how dare you? How dare you? Well, there's really good prices for those. Yeah, but they're not like on the card. Well, no, no, but they're one card. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. What's this? A card game? Yeah. That's cute. Card game. That's cute. Check this out, guys. This is probably the biggest, the jumbo freaking case collectors. Is there going to be anything in it? Whoa, look Whoa. at that artwork. Hey. Got Castle Grace going. Is that like preceding the moon? Like so, from, yeah. from like the new adventures line? <laughs> Smell. Wow. Sniff, sniff. I love it. I give it a good sniff. A good sniffy? Is it past this? Yeah. This is actually pretty cool. Well, this could actually function as a playset because could. you could put them on there. Um, yes. Love the artwork inside all of these things look check this out you got ram man just knocking out skeletor he's like oh, how man. freaking cool is that <laughs> but this is going to be too big yeah to, bring to even put in in my yeah. name so it won't fit it, it, it won't fit it won't fit it won't fit i know i know ah uh, pretty awesome store if every everything you want transformers turks motu randall even have some super powers. this is the clerk's Black and white edition, which is pretty cool. Yeah, that one. No, I don't. I don't collect these really. But um, it's interesting. He kind of looks like a zombie, doesn't he? He does. I, I was like, is that like a zombie, like bear? Yeah. It's just black and white. Yeah. So I mean, it's, 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 a, it's a cool piece. Yeah. But the, what's really cool about this is that you could, if you get them, you could build like uh, RST video yeah. and clerks, the quick stop groceries. That's cool. So if anything, just kind of going after these sets just to build the diorama would be pretty cool. Yeah. yeah. And I mean, it's actually a good deal. It's 24 bucks. Yeah. Which is big. I would rip it open and be able to yeah, just kind of pack it. It's sexually yeah. a good thing. Yeah. But like, look, check it out. You could build. Are you a clerks fan? I saw clerks. Yeah. So you could build the set. Oh, with wow. These, which I think That's is pretty neat. That's a, but it's in black. Oh, yeah, but it is in black and white. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. okay. Dummy head. That's why I was like, oh, black one. Oh, yeah, because it's clear. Oh, oh, right. right. <laughs> Underdog's kind of a. Uh, oh, yeah. 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 That's cool. I love that. I was doing resale stuff for a while. Okay. And I always was into toys, especially fantasy side of the of statues and things like that. And uh, so it just, I, I had an engineering job in Springfield, Missouri, came back home, and it kind of happened through attrition. You know, I, uh, the shop came open. Somebody was selling it, so I was like, "Hey, that's a cool idea, you know. You know, maybe I can do something with it." And, and I just went ahead and purchased the shop and the inventory that they had in it. And, and the next thing you know, here we are, seven years later. So, okay. so yeah, it's definitely a, a fun interest. I was more the, like I said, more fantasy D and D. Oh, okay. You know, you know, wizards, dragons, that kind of stuff. Uh, DC, big Batman fan. So, so yeah, that's pretty also much how I got Star into Wars it. guy. Or? Yeah, Star Wars. Um, yeah, definitely into Star Wars. Once since I was yay big, <laughs> saw the first movie when I was a little kid. You know, I would have been seven years old, something like that, six. Yeah. What, what toys did you play with? So you, you played Dungeons so, and Dragons. And yeah, Wars? big Dungeons and Dragons. Big into the Star Wars action figures. You know, I had. I had a <laughs> sandbox at home that all my stuff got ruined in. You know, that was Tatooine, and uh, and then I had Hoth inside. Uh, essentially, we had a white carpet that I would use as the Hoth and in your freezer. So all my, oh yeah, exactly. <laughs> no, all my Hoth stuff was the only stuff that stayed good. So because because I didn't take it outside and ruin it. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, so that was that was the big things. I had uh, Shogun Warrior. I, it was oh, probably wow. my favorite toy from back in the day. Yeah. The, the rocket firing fists and all that, yeah, I would roll that around everywhere in the house. So, so yeah, been big into it since I was a little kid. Just had a little hiatus, you know, coming out of college. Time Warp Toys and More, St. Louis, Missouri. Uh, welcome to our shop. <laughs> See, this is what it's all about. Yeah. You, you ask about Dungeons and Dragons stuff, and then you run to it and grab all of it. So, <laughs> you like, wanted it too. Yeah. They're like, hey, we got some D and D figures over here. I already had all of them in my hands. Yeah, and had them all. I was like, like but how, how, how can you not grab these? Look, look at how cool this is. These aren't even the posable L Gen ones. This is just the TSR, mm -hmm. um, BZ type dudes. That's also a crazy cool looking one. He comes with a little dude. 
you got some of the army guys here. Bam. Crossbows and stuff. And yeah, wow, look yeah. at that. So, yeah, we're, we're gonna be gentlemen about it and, yeah. and divide a monster there. I'll take these, so these orange dudes. It's and kind of um, a redemption story. Redemption from, story? Yeah, from. We'll go back to Trader's Village when you grab okay. that Christ Star figure from Greco. You wouldn't okay. let it up. So, you had all these in your hand, but you actually shared chip. No, no, I can have Yeah, so that is. Why not? That's nice. Why wouldn't I do that? Because you took that figure from Greco. I did it? You totally took it. I have I'm leaving. I have <laughs> What's going down? Oh, he grabbed them all. I grabbed them all. Ooh. He grabbed them all. Yeah. But then. He was like, you know what? We yeah, can split well, it. Okay, so did you guys just do a mini draft? Yeah. 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 That went like, you know what? You look pretty. You can have some. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we had all these. Hey, you you eat. Yeah. I, 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 I was like, there's, you know, there's two big monsters. There's a couple of the little guys. Let's yeah. just each take one monster, and he let me choose which ones uh, were more to my liking. Yeah. So. Got to do that. So yeah, and, uh, do you going to be happy about it? And I'm going to look for other stuff. Oh, I love yeah, that. this story. Dude, great deals too. I yeah. Love it. So yeah, yeah. That's a happy. Yeah. You have a collection now. Yeah. Now you have. Show. Yeah, you're going home with a full collection. That's awesome. See these Ewoks? I mean, not Ewoks. Oh yeah, that's Ewoks. But it's vintage collection. Never mind. Oh, is this all vintage collection stuff? Oh, uh, where's some? Where's some vi vintage vintage? <laughs> It's all mixed. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I've seen them like pieces of them loose, but yeah, this, they have like an entire Gumby collection. That's, right That's cool, dude. Yeah. Pirate Gumby? Um, cowboy Pokey? Yeah. And they're not that expensive. No, right? they're not. They're Where's Frigol $10. And yeah. $10. Poke $10. Yeah. And yeah. I bet. Okay. Dude, that one, yeah, that might be a maybe right there. Yeah, that's face cool, poke. Yeah, yeah. If, uh, that's awesome. Yeah. yeah. All right, guys. So, kind of want to get that silver hogs. Forty-five. Forty-five. That's down. Yeah. Excuse the language. I, I think. Apologize. I think I'm gonna get it. I'm still here. Yeah. Hey. What do you think? What do you think, dude? I think it's 45. cool looking. Yeah. Like, is that something you want? Yeah. It's soaring. It's, yeah. Does it have the uh, no broken wings? Does he have the wind beneath his wing? I mean, I'm going to be going to this thing. I mean, I've been picking them up. Oh, for real? Yeah. It's not just it really 45 like yeah. yeah. It's pretty like, like you were saying. It's like, yeah. It's what probably a delivery fee though, because yeah, they're going to have to see them. Come out. I'm getting down. How clean that is. Turtles, we have one turtle layer. So I'm a little bit torn. I'm definitely getting this guy. They're going to give me a good deal on him for like 15 bucks on him. Um, but the superpowers, Superman. Hmm. Do I pull the trigger on it or do I hand that over to Ed and then use mine and get another Star Wars figure? What do you think? Does Ed want it? Yeah, it yeah. was. Oh. Yeah. I, mean, I think we should manipulate Ed. Well, Ed did do a good deed earlier. What was his good deed? He found all those D&Ds. Had them all in his hands, but he shared them with me. Yeah, he did. Uh, okay, but, but did he do a good deed when he stole that Crystar figure from me? So I, yeah. I was, we were talking about that. I said this is kind of Ed's redemption story. No, it was not. I didn't get redeemed. You yeah, had. but I did. I mean, I benefited from it. <laughs> See, I'm in a, I'm in a position right now where. Mine's more of a financial thing in terms of how much I'm comfortable spending at this store knowing what we have coming ahead of us. Yeah, we're so it. it's do I use my forty dollars that I was gonna send spend on Superman on Star Wars or you know what I mean? Yeah. Fifteen dollars for Yeah, I got fifteen on this guy. Yeah. So I'm I'm super happy with this one. This is an obvious pickup. Um how's this cape? It's a good cape. It's a good cape. Mm -hmm. Money's in the cape. The money is always yeah. in the cape. I'll say you pass it off, dude. Huh? I'll say you pass it off. Be nice and move on to another one. We'll find them. Yeah. We'll Fine. double it and give it to the next person. Yeah. yeah. Okay. <laughs> All right. All right. So we're checking out some of these um, talking plushes, and right now we're kind of just checking to see what they go for. And uh, what are you thinking? So Jimmy over here, my pal Jimmy. They have it for fifty-four ninety-nine. The less sold comps. One sold for one twenty-five, free shipping, and another sold for 
Uh, 200 or best, 200 offer. best offers. So we don't know what the best offer was. I'm just trying to weigh like with the shipping costs and eBay fees. You know, is it worth it? Because I don't want to keep it for me. Great deal if you want to own it, but. This is one of those pieces that like, may kind of make you feel better about buying yeah, something else for yourself later. Oh, like, absolutely. Because that's yeah. what it's about. So Time War Toys is a definite hit if you're in the St. Louis area. We found out about the store like the night before. We were at dinner. I was doing a little research and I found out. I was like, hey guys, we got to stop here. The owner was great. The staff was great. Um, the prices were even better. So if you're in the area, check them out. And this is what I picked up. So I'm sure you saw Ed and I fighting over these D&D figures. I got five of them total, and Ed was uh, nice enough to share with me, so thank you, buddy. I got all five of these. And then my biggest pickup from that shop was this 1987 Telepix Tallyhawk. Check it out, he is 100% complete. No broken clips, got all the missiles, all the functions work perfectly and he looks fantastic on top of my display. So $45 I thought was a heck of a deal, so I had to pull the trigger on it. I knew it, this would probably be one of the items that I looked back and was like, you know what, I wish I would have gotten that, and I am super glad I did. Guys, that's gonna do it for this episode of Attic Invaders. Make sure you are subscribed to the channel, like the video, make sure you're following. It's Retro Geek Out, Grip of Fabulous, Boss and Mike, Back Alley Toys, and guys, we will see you on the next adventure. Peace.